Okay, uh, hello folks. I want to introduce myself. My name is Zaki Wahid. And this is my uh, first English tutorial. Which um, try to uh, make uh, some like a realistic pencil with the uh, <coughs> 3D animation program like uh, such as a very free uh, <coughs> capable and very powerful program this is just like a <coughs> sorry 3D blender here okay uh, I will try to make a 2B I mean a pencil a computer pencil that uh, many of the uh, students who try to make a simple like uh, final examination so they use uh, such like these pencils so uh, first thing first we uh, open the blender and uh, we uh, delete the uh, default cube here by hitting delete and we add a new cylinder when hitting shift A uh, and we turn to six vertices here so uh, the shapes will be like this and rotate it by hitting R so you can hit it the control so that you can uh, make the uh, rotation will be more uh, managed then. you change to the edit mode now and we try to select the face there's many faces there and we are uh, want to add uh, some like a new um, segment here so we can control R and we add the segment by scrolling scrolling the uh, scroll button on my mouse so you scroll up so you add four segments new segments or new adding new edges by scrolling up the uh, scroll button on the mouse for every edge six edge that we have to add four edges I mean six faces to add to uh, add more edges or segments here okay uh, all of the uh, faces will be turned to front view and we add a little we select the middle of the vertices here so only six vertices here we selected because when we add the proportional editing to the sphere a shape so it's like magnetic you know I mean uh, when you grab it with the G key on the keyboard so it's like a uh, another another uh, vertice is not uh, going with the selected vertice so it's like a uh, uh, magnetic things here uh, I have uh, s such a wrong thing here when the selection this vertices so uh, we have to uh, yeah this is one and we have to turn off the limit selection so we can select the uh, other side of vertices uh, the hidden vertices on the other side so we can we can select all the vertices include the 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 back side of the vertices and we now uh, try to extrude by hitting E key, key on the keyboard and hitting X will will be uh, uh, moving along of this X axis uh, so we can add uh, like this one we can uh, now to turn turn okay in the uh, so the other side of the vertice is not selection so now we try to the back side the front side in the front side of uh, vertices so what, why we the different when we an extra uh, the x-axis on the front side this one.
so and we shrink it down by hitting S so it's curled down so now we will try to select the middle vertices like uh, we have to select before and we try to yeah uh, enable okay and what but with the random uh, yeah I like this one oops try again hitting G when you grab it to the front don't forget to hit X so you can grab it along of this X axis select the middle vertices and we grab it to the front so it's like uh, the uh, don't forget to disable the uh, okay and then select to the front this is will be the uh, pencil now we concentrate to the uh, back side of the pencil by selecting the vertices and then hitting E for extrude X for the X axis and we can several time so we can make a short or long pencil. It's, it's depends depend of uh, what what we want to try to to do the here. We select the middle vertices on the back sides and delete the vertices so it's look. Uh, we add we the idea is we want to make uh, like a not sharp uh, things on the back. Select the edges here. Okay, now the edges are selected. Hitting E for extra. Hitting E again for extra. And then we try to uh, hit S to scale it down. Try to hit E again to scale it down. When you we selected the uh, edges now the vertices hitting R M to merge it to one vertice in the center okay we have finished now this is the pencil we have modeled I mean modeling the pencil now try to select the edge I mean the faces for the front of the pencil and then hit B to separate the middle thing hit B separate and the back to happy again I mean select the faces hit B and 
enter so we have one two three four different object now we try to smooth the four object so we get more realistic thing on the pencil uh, oh um, it's not getting smooth we have to add more modifier here okay like a smooth modifier uh, we, we add but we sh like the on the repeat we have to make it zero on the repeat because we don't want to mo get uh, smoothing or many smoothing here uh, don't forget this back side of the uh, pencil and we add with the modifier again and turn the repeat to the zero and on the object tools we can add shading uh, smooth on shading on the back side okay <coughs> sorry now we have tried to get a material get the new material and return it with to black and RGP 0 0 0 and the middle we turn it to the blue okay uh, so it's like a blue and the uh, front turn it to little brown brownie or little uh, okay a little brown here and the front we have to get like a little uh, gray it's not a lot back okay now we finish for the material the simple thing when we separate the up the pencil to many objects so we can uh, you can <coughs> add in the material the different way okay we select all of the object and we grab it and we can hit a zero on the keyboard so you can to the camera view and on the world we can turn the ambient occlusion so it's like a more realistic with the uh, more lighting realistic li realistic lighting I mean sorry and we add plane so you can wh why you add plane down of the pencil because we have to uh, give some like a shed our shading on the pencil so we add plane down of the pen down on the pencil so we, we add plane with hitting shift a and then we grab it up to uh, a big or uh, yeah long the so like this one hitting and hit scale so you can look on the pencils and down of the pencils is a, we have a shader of the pencil so that the idea why we give a plane on the down of the pencil so now with when we turn on the indirect um, I mean the environment lighting our sorry uh, f we, we we turn off the fall off and we add the strength to uh, 0 0.1 so it's like a more more realistic hitting F12 when you want to try to render on the in the end of this tutorial Okay, try to grab the camera and select the camera here. Grab the camera again, hit F12 to render 
nice yes very nice okay uh, this is the idea how to make the pencil maybe uh, the audience or you have to any any more tricky or more have any idea to make more realistic pencil you can just give us your comment so you can try to here I try to add environmental lighting so this will be more lighting on the environment to like you know but when we turn off the environment lighting it's, it's like more realistic I think okay uh, thank you for your attention for my tutorial so next time you can add me your comment thank you very much